Hey kids, Arvo. As you can tell from what's in front of me, I love fruit. Check out my fruit bowl. I've got some red apples, I've got some green apples, I've got some homegrown limes, I've got some tasty blood oranges, some yummy bananas, and even some chopped up rock melon. All delicious. I'm sure you love fruit as well. Uh, it's tasty, it's sweet, it gives you energy and keeps you going throughout the day. Now do you know what? The Bible tells us that when we're friends with Jesus, we grow fruit. That's right, we grow fruit. So does that mean we turn into this guy? No, thankfully. We don't actually turn into a fruit monster. Uh, but the Bible says that when we're friends with Jesus, his spirit comes and lives in us, and we start to grow the fruit of the spirit. What's the fruit of the spirit? Well, here's what the Bible says in Galatians 5 verse 22. The fruit of the spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. When His Spirit lives in us, we start to grow fruit. Now think of it this way. What does an apple tree grow? That's right, apples. What does a banana tree grow? That's right, bananas. What does a lime tree grow? Easy, isn't it? Limes. Now let me ask you, what does a Holy Spirit tree grow? Well, it grows the fruit of the Spirit, love, joy, peace, and all the others. When you're a Christian, you are like a tree that grows tasty fruit, the Spirit's fruit. And just like this fruit makes people happy and gives them nice taste in their mouth, when you grow the fruit of the Spirit, you will make people happy. And you will bring great flavour and colour to the world by living just like Jesus did. How cool is that? Now for our Kids Arvo videos for the next nine weeks, we're going to be learning all about the fruit of the Spirit. Uh, and I hope you can join us online. Every second Wednesday we're going to meet on Zoom together uh, and talk and play some games. And then every other week we're going to send one of these videos out that you can watch at home with Mum and Dad. So remember, when you love Jesus, you will grow fruit. I'm going to list off those fruit again. And I'm going to leave you with a quick question that you can discuss. Which of these fruit do you wish you could grow more of? Here they all are. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Which one would you like to grow more of? Have a chat with your mum and dad and your family, and I'll see you all next week.